What is up, people? I am almost certainly real. I, uh, just playing around a little bit with, um, this Battlefield Defender game, North End Tower Defense. I, I just played a little bit randomly just to try to unlock some stuff, try out some different things. I think the bicycle unlock was maybe a little bit, uh, bit of an oopsie in terms of actually what you want to do if you want to beat the game. Um... 200 gold for a, a unit that disappears instantly is uh, not efficient early in the game. Potentially later on it might be, but uh, medic, yeah, you like to see that. You think to yourself, what do you want in a game? You want a medic. Give me some troops. I like it. Stack down some... I can get some mines going in the front line. Um, lightning speed. That seems like the best thing to get. Get that bicycler. Got him. Gotta watch that side. Machine gun. That's uh, something I want to try out here. 300. Ooh, not inexpensive. Not inexpensive, but uh, hopefully... Hopefully does some damage for us. Um, yeah, let's keep dropping in some guys. Let's build up some mines in the front here. Oh, I yeah, I meant to be saving my gold to do to do the machine gunner, but I spent it. Expert healer, sure. Love to have. Okay. Ooh, interesting. So I can... Can he... Is that his maximum distance type of thing? It's somewhat short range, if we're to be honest. Hmm. Uh, faster hands. Yeah, I don't know how good that is until... Uh, until I can get enough of them, right? Like... And, and stuff's actually in their range. It feels like at the moment... Um, let's just get a medic or two more. Keep that heal going. Because it's... He, he's, he's halfway dead. And uh, I, I think he's killed one unit. If I've done my calculations correctly. Okay. Okay, when stuff starts coming in, he does work, but, uh... I think we need... We need to get a couple more... A couple more units. Um, let me use these mines. Let me use these airborne. Why don't we get some guys up in there? Um... Eh, we'll slap down a barbed wire or two. Um... Over here, where we don't have the machine gunner. Uh... Yeah, because these guys are definitely all, like, too long range. Maybe we, maybe eventually we get some range upgrades on this. But, uh, okay. Maybe yeah, a little little too many machine gunners over on the left-hand side, but... Say lovey. Say lovey. And I, the bazooka I, I used once last round. I didn't, I didn't love it, if I'm to be honest. Um, do this, do this. I think we need to get one or two units there for the long range stuff. Um, keep, I should keep building those mines, I think. Get that medic upgrade. Keep, keep getting some minefields going up here. I think we can go for a bomber thing. If I'm to be honest, it does feel like potentially, um... I should be artillerying the battlefield rather than actually getting upgrades. But, uh, okay. Um. There we go. I guess we can stack units on top of each other. Looks like we lost. We lost a machine gunner over here, which feels a bad man. As they are not inexpensive. Um. Double mag. Why not? 
Um, you can bomb this. You guys, let's get some more mines going. Okay, I've got, I've got the money for some more machine gunners. Let's do that. Grenades, that sounds nice to me. Um, that guy's still alive, okay. And maybe need some more medics. I've not built a medic in a little while. I kind of feel like I'm... Maybe, uh... No, I'm not going to get the bazooka. I'm kind of... I'm into the machine gunner right now. That's my jam. Basically... Ooh. Oh, that was the medic heal. AoE heal. That feels strong. Um, more mines. And let's bomb over here. This, this left-hand side. I don't know why I chose the parachuting tr troops there. Um, okay, we can do that there. Um, yeah, this, this side over here feels like it's getting a little bit of stuff coming at it. Coin rush. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that because I want another machine gunner. Um, airborne and bombers. Okay, we are running low on stuff being alive. Yeah, we'll take, we'll take the money. We're just going to spam these machine gunners and see how that goes for us. It seems to be going better. I will say that. Maybe we should have some more medics down, but... Uh, I don't know that I have the the gold for, for both bombers and medics, and I don't know what's best. Um, yeah, let's get me a parachuting. Okay, we don't have much left in the way of commander points, which is fine. And I think I just, I keep, I feel like I spam these machine guns. Ooh, in combination with medics. Um, yeah, give me some reinforcements. It definitely seems to be doing more work than the, uh, the regular guys in terms of cost efficiency. Um, definitely seem to be better than the bazookas. I, I played them once there last round. Okay, we've got a lot more of these, these sort of CP points coming in. Give me gold. And then we can go ahead and bomb. Uh, and we'll just drop in some guys here. I think... I think the gold is the best use because I can just get more of these machine gunners. And I think that that is basically what I want to do. Um, just going to spam machine guns. And a little bit of medic, a little bit of medic, a little bit of medic, and more machine guns. Can we get another one in here? Yeah, okay, uh, and let's work on our frontline mines, make sure we can't get any, any of those, we'll take an artillery strike, um, we can go ahead and bomb, let's get that up there, I always feel like that left hand side ends up becoming an issue, and let's keep working on our minefields, we've got some gold, let's spend it artillery battlefield. I think that that is a fairly efficient use of that upgrade at this point in the game. Keep on doing that. Keep on airborning some troops in. Um, I'm wondering if I can use the, the airborne troops to kind of sit in front of these machine guns. These machine gunners are crazy good, though, compared to everything else we've had. Because um, we have not made it nearly this far. Um, and let's keep keep those minefields going. Keep those minefields getting built up. As we got gold, maybe a medic or two more. The airplanes are always a little a little scary, you know. Um, definitely gonna go ahead and hit that with a artillery. Maybe I get the bazookas. I I, I don't know. It feels like the bazookas were really bad compared to these machine gunners. They just seem to die, but. I think I'll, I'll get them next if I do see them. Because maybe we're to the point of the game where it does become... Okay, uh, keep going with this barbed wire stuff there. And let's drop that in. Um, okay, we'll, we'll take the bazooka. 
We'll give them give them a shot. They do have better range than the machine gunners, so now that we have the machine gunners to cover them, maybe they'll be quite good, but they didn't seem great on their own. And keep working on our minefield, get some longer range units. And let's take that artillery there. Um, so yeah, potentially the bazooka guys are going to be more decent now that there's just such a such a concentration of enemies. And keep working on these minefields. Make sure those bicyclers do not make it through. Do not want that. Nobody on bicycles, please. Um, bomb the battlefield. Airborne me and some units. Um, and how much gold do we have? I don't want to go too hard into the bazookas. You know? Because um, I feel like the machine gunners have been real real asset in a way the bazooka guys were not in the last game I played, but maybe it's just I didn't get to the point where there was enough AoE, right? Because the the bazooka guys are kind of like hard AoE unit. The machine gunners still seem kind of single targety. Uh, so we'll go we'll get some bazookas going. We'll get a couple of them. And we, we really do have a lot more gold. Um, I think at this point, I just artillery the battlefield type of thing. Okay, okay, I gotta use, gotta use my commander points as well. Forgetting about that and get some airborne guys. Get some more medics. Artillery battlefield, thank you. And let's go for some bazookas. I kind of trying to watch to see them and it's like I don't feel super impressed but uh, 200 coins I think that that is not a lot of room for guys anymore um, oh yeah obviously got to keep spamming this Let's get that last barbed wire up. Keep working on my minefields. Expand it a little bit. Let's drop drop the bomber in there. Um, 200 golds. And let's go. Yeah, maybe I do go spam bazookas now. Because there's just so many units, right? Like that... Artillery battlefield. I feel like that's just worth In terms of the total amount. I mean, maybe not once we have more upgrades, right, and more stuff. I think that that becomes less less useful. But okay, we got way too much gold. Um, let's build a couple medics or more, right? The AOE on the medics all of a sudden I think is kind of insane. Um, Use maybe some more machine gunners here. Okay, we're definitely in a better better spot than we were last game by a substantive amount. So my takeaway is these machine gunner guys are insane. Um, and I don't even have any upgrades for them. Like these guys, yeah. Yeah, they are uh, uh, kind of nutty. Coin rush that lets me get more machine gunners. Maybe if I have room. You know, I think the bazookas, it's kind of hard to see. It seems like they're doing a bit of work for me. Um, coin rush, I think. Yeah, the bazookas do quite a bit, like, sometimes. And then the, the machine gunners do insane cleanup. Seems to be, like, a good good overall. Maybe I just... Maybe I don't artillery strike and I just say I take the coins. Eh. I guess still probably better. It's hard to find a spot to build. Um... 
Then I think I'll just keep up on the medics. Two, three. Just make sure I'm balancing those out. Oh, right. Definitely have to get this stuff. Mines. Keep working on my minefields. Uh, airborne. Why not? Get me some guys. Artillery battlefields. And... Some more bazookas. Give me that hard AoE damage. And let's artillery the battlefield. And I think that's a good combo of stuff that we got. The bazookas and the machine guns. I think the last time I played, I just... I didn't have um, enough... Uh, I didn't have enough... Uh, early game to the po get to the point where bazookas became good. I think now they are decent for us um, There you go. We can get some more guys in here. We got a shit ton of money There we go. I just got to find a places I can build um, The medics seem kind of key though to keep keep everyone healed up uh, and let's do that again. Medic here, medic here, medic here, medic here. Because they've got an AoE heal now, right? And that, I guess, just becomes insane. Uh, medic here, medic there. And keep working on... Okay, we won. We won. That, uh... That was way, way easier with the machine gunner. We've got ourselves a lot of coins. What are coins? Oh no, that's okay. That's the in-game thing. That's not any kind of meta progression stuff. Almost two thousand. Okay, let's uh, go back. Check out the upgrades we unlocked. So maybe not. Uh, Twenty-five percent more health doesn't seem super useful. Bigger radius also doesn't seem super useful. You know, because they just, they have something to fire at. If it was a longer range, that would be useful. Slow, that definitely seems useful. Pierce, that seems insane. And no reload. So that th those last two upgrades seem kind of nutty. Um, interesting. We'll have to give the other map a try, because I think the other map goes a little bit deeper. Um, the sniper feels like it might be worth picking up as well. Um... What's the difference between these guys? I guess I can't I can't see until I unlock. What do we get here for this guy? Increased health, that seems crappy. Ooh, never miss. That that seems very good to get. Uh discount? Eh. Bigger explosion. And a slow on it. So that bigger explosion and the slow seems very good. I think the critical upgrade is better rocket. Um Cool. Awesome. I will, uh, I'll definitely keep playing because I do eventually want to do some sort of weird bicycle run. Even with the bicycle cost reduction by 30%, it's still going to be like, what, 150-ish? I don't know if that is spammable, right? Versus you build like, what were, what are these costs? 300 or 250 and they stay there forever? We'll see. We'll see what we can do. Um, I'm not sure that the balance in this game is amazing yet. Uh, but maybe it, that's just the way it's meant to be played, is you should unlock stuff in order. And the the next map is potentially a lot more difficult. Uh, but it is an early access, so that is, uh, is one of the consequences of early access games. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day.